What up, people? All right, I'm a little ticked off. It's my third time doing this. <laughs> it's your boy Malik Joe. Uh, this is the Why Am I Like This podcast because why the fuck am I like this? And I know it's been a long time. It's been, what, a month since I've had made a new one. I'm sorry about that. Um, I got tied up with the whole it's a new year. You know, I got some good things going on. I got some health insurance. Whoop the fucking do. I got some dental insurance. Hee ha, hee ha. Um, don't know what those two things were, but yeah, whatever. Um, uh, <laughs> I'm looking to try to get some braces, get my teeth fixed up. I just need to have health insurance just because, because I just, I'm an adult. I should just have it. Um, yeah. And, uh, you know, I'm on my new gym regimens and stuff like that. I'm training a couple of people and, uh, you know, it's like, it's a little tiring, you know, but I'm, I'm back on the ball and I'm not going to drop it. All right. All right. <laughs> um today is monday february the 13th the day before valentine's day holy shit valentine's day i hate these fucking holidays because they're fucking stupid because society says we have to do things for these fucking holidays and whatever um if you guys don't know me if you guys do follow me on instagram my name is the real me leak joe and you guys know that i give my girlfriend a present once a week every week for a whole year that's my goal to have 365 presents by the end of the year that was given to her. But um, the thing is, these fucking holidays fucked me up, man. Because, you know, when I'm getting the presents during the week, it's like I get her whatever I want her to have, you know. But these Valentine's Days and birthdays and fucking Christmas, she wants what she wants to have. And it's like she wants me to be, she wants to be surprised. So, like, I don't, it's hard to find a medium when whereas though, like, I can't tell her that I'm buying that because she will fucking flip out because she wants to be surprised. And it's just a fucking whole lady thing. I hate it. It's just whatever. Um, it just stresses me the fuck out, you know? I'm, I'll be so happy when this day is over and we can go back to the normal until the end of the year because her birthday is right after fucking Christmas. And I know you don't give a shit about this information that I'm giving you, but I don't give a fuck because I'm giving it to you anyway. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so uh, yeah, Valentine's Day tomorrow. Who the fuck created Valentine's Day? Like, who just thought this was just like, all right, man, today we're just going to just do shit for women. I mean, because that's what it's for. I mean, a lot of people say, you need to do something for you. It's for fucking women, all right? You fucking do something nice for the ladies, all right? That's, that's what it is. And um, it's just an annoying-ass holiday. It's just, it is. It really is. Like, what the fuck? I mean, I, I know, whatever, whatever. But, I mean, I got to thank the holiday as well, because I am in the service industry business, and uh, it's like the second best year day of the year besides like Mother's Day so yeah I thank you but I'm not working Valentine's Day this year but either way yeah shout out to anybody that's in the service industry um what else is new with me uh my wardrobe change has been dramatic over the last month I am now 207 pounds last time I probably talked to you I was probably like 190 185 um yeah Whew. uh I've just been working out man super hard and um eating right and just you know the and the crazy part is I just started cardio. Like, I wasn't doing cardio because I wanted to get... I just wanted to be 200 pounds. Like, I wanted to get to 200 pounds. And just because I just wanted to do it in my life because I've never been 200 pounds before. I just wanted to do it to see what it does. And it wasn't like a sloppy 200. Like, I was like, I'm like I'm, I'm muscular. I work out. And um, I finally got the 200. And I was like, okay, well, then I'll just be cool here or whatever. And uh, I actually started cardio, more cardio, and, like... You know, still lifting, still eating right, and and that my weight's going up. I'm like 207 now. I'm still still going up, but the fucking clothes are. I don't even own. I don't own a pair of jeans at this moment because I can't get a pair of jeans to fucking fit me, and uh, I feel like a fucking female. This is weird. It's, this is so weird. Like I I have the same waist size, and my thighs and ass have gotten twice as big, and I can't fucking fit anything. And I don't think people really know my struggle, man. The quality of my fucking pant has to go all the way up like I wear joggers now a lot because you know joggers and sweatpants because I just I just have to but um the fucking pants I can't even fucking buy it I mean yeah whatever I used to shop at H&M but I can't really buy H&M pants anymore because you know they're they're ripping the day I have to like up my fucking quality to $50 a fucking jean like every normal human being and that's bullshit <laughs> I thought it was gonna be the scheme my whole life but I can't do it and uh it's a fucking pain in the ass man Oh, anyway, all right. Uh, <laughs> you guys know I can't fucking cook, and I've been ordering out like a son bitch, and um, I should probably learn how to cook. I think I should. I think I'm going to actually learn an entree a week. 
to do. And I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna learn on it, read on it, get all the measurements, get all the supplies for it, and I'm gonna cook that meal maybe on a Sunday, every Sunday. Cause I'm off, I'm off, or maybe on Monday, cause you know, I'm whatever, I don't have work. Uh, yeah. <laughs> fucking A, man. Um, shout out to the fucking Patriots, man. They fucking did it. Yeah, I know, I know, I'm late. I'm, well, I'm not late, but you know, I'm just late with the podcast, but fucking Patriots, man. Five motherfucking times. Fuck the Patriots. Fucking Tom Brady. Fucking Tom Brady. He said he revenge. He didn't play four games. He's like, man, fuck it. I'm going. Co- I'm coming back for revenge. <laughs> I fucked that. I botched that all up. <laughs> oh man, fuck you, Drake. I'm coming for revenge. <laughs> How the fuck does he do that? <laughs> uh, Tom Brady, man, he's a fucking goat, man. And you're fucking Joe Montana hating on him. Well, it's hard to call somebody the greatest of all time if we're still like, man, get the fuck out. He's the greatest of all time. I, I'm not trying to hear that shit. When he retired, he is the GOAT, and he is the only GOAT. It's hard to get goals from football, man. So many players, some players not on the field all the time, you know? It's like, he's, but he, that nigga's the GOAT, man. He's the GOAT. Can't fucking stop his shine. Can't slow him down. Oh, no. <laughs> I got the kid. No, I'm sure. Um, hey, man, he's fucking... He's a shit. Also, another GOAT, John Cena, 16-time world champ, just uh, tied Ric Flair's record. And which Ric Flair just did the wing bowl in the fucking Philadelphia. Yay. Yeah. Um, yeah, man, shout out to John Cena for tying that fucking record, man. And it was an awesome fucking match. I know, guys, a lot of people are not really into the WWE, but I still is. And that's the bottom line, because Stone Cold said, no, I'm just joking. Um, yeah, man, it was a great fucking match. It was awesome. He put the stamp on it. Even though he just lost his fucking belt last night, but uh, yeah, that's for another argument. Um, I'm also gonna start be start doing uh, movie reviews at least one a week. Um, yeah, and then and that's that's gonna be a thing too. Fuck it, I'm I'm gonna I'm trying to take over the YouTube game. Fuck it, I know I got in late. Well, I got in early and then I got back out and then I got back in. So, whatever, take it how you want it. The camera, fuck. I, mean, I just like to do things. I like whatever. Whatever's on my mind, I'm doing that shit. I'm not wasting no more time with shit. I'm just gonna fucking just put it out. I don't even give a fuck what the reaction is. It's just out there. Um, yeah, man. So I'll be going to the fucking dentist March 1st to get my shit aligned. I'm getting some new tattoos for my birthday. It's a lot of shit popping over here, all right? And uh, this has been the Malik Joe Fast Cast. I know this shit wasn't informative. And I know you ain't learned nothing, but you know, follow your boy at the real Malik Joe on Instagram. You know what I mean? Over and the fuck out.